we will be covering uh, uh, these topics uh, in in this course we have covered the introductions now we will be moving to option chain basics most of you might be knowing what option chain basics are but uh, this is just a refresher moving on this is a nsa website um, and i am looking at the nifty option chain so not much to look uh, but uh, can you tell me in which direction market has moved just by looking at the option chain giving you a minute to think about it okay um, if you are still thinking you can pause the video here uh, let me continue market must have moved downwards because you can see the call have lost prices across the board and puts have gained it so if I have to tell you So put basically means if you are selling put, you, you are betting that this is a put level, the strike price, that if you are selling, the market will remain above this price. If you are buying put, you are betting that market will remain below this price point. What does effectively it means is that the option chain is uh, seller's market so when you're looking that prices are increasing across the board on decreasing it that means people are expecting the market will go down further and hence the premiums are increasing on the put side similarly on the call side when market is falling since it's a seller market the premium will start reducing so to go back to the screen when I'm expecting that uh, put sell the market will remain above a uh, certain uh, level okay now if something the uh, market is price is falling here the risk is increasing for this level right since the risk is increasing this bet is increasing the premium so all the put prices all the strikes they will gain price and sellers will have more juice to sell and buyers will have to pay more premium to uh, buy these strikes okay now we have covered uh, the, what net change uh, means and where the market has moved second point is how to check the direction so this is just end of the day that where the market has moved and hence it happened but what is the general direction so you can find all the data pertaining to this script for this expiry in this uh, option chain board. There is no other data available uh, and, and everything is um, which is required is here. So if you look at the OI, this is the total open interest for calls. This is calls and this is the total uh, open interest for puts. So if I have to check what is the put to call ratio which i call P, which we call pcr so all i have to do is put to call means put divide by call so put is 17447625 divide by 23502375 the pcr is 0.74 you can verify this if you search on Google um, IIFL PCR you will find the PCRs here as well for index so we are looking at 20th it's 0.74 our calculator says 0.74 not just this you can also calculate uh, previous day PCR so this is the OI for today this is the change in OI change in OI is uh, how what what is a net change but there is no total given here so what you can do is you can simply copy the data one second put it to the excel and do this So I 
I'm doing the sum here. I'm doing the sum here. Sum here, sum here. PCR today equal to this is the put divided by this is the call 0.74 PCR yesterday will be um control Z. So put yesterday total put yesterday is equal to this minus this call yesterday will be equal to this minus this so PCR yesterday will be this by this so yesterday um, it was above one and now it has fallen below one what it means is um, the number of puts sold were higher yesterday than calls and today number of puts sold are way lesser than uh, calls sold we will come back to this concept again jumping back so this is how you can look at the uh, option chain you will know uh, what is the price at which you can sell any strike the price at which you can buy what was the total quantity sold and sold and buy the current LTP going on and the change in the price so basically this also you can find that for 1050 if today's price is 680 so 680 and this is green so which means um, your price yesterday was this minus this so this minus this is 680 minus 235 it's 4.45 similarly this minus this will mean simply it got added so 2.65 minus minus 0.2 so yesterday price was 2.85 that's all for option basics.